Pua. Pua. What's going on, guys? It's Flux here, and welcome back to the Sims 5 single player sandbox. Let's I gotta like slow down here. Welcome back to the Sim City 5 single player sandbox. Let's play. Uh, this is the first city, uh, Sawyer Sand. I haven't named it these yet, but this is the uh, Electronic City and the uh, Tourism City. And uh, of course, we're trying to work towards getting this great work built right now, the uh, Arcology Center. Uh, looks like we are receiving shipments. Uh, well, we should be sending and receiving shipments. Here we go. 4,500 TVs are sent so far. 35 alloy and 42 metal. So we're getting there, I guess. Lots of stuff to go. Uh, but in the meantime, I plan on getting working on our new city. So um, I guess now the decision is, should we go ahead and... I'm thinking the best thing to do now is to build like an industry city, like over here. Uh, we'll see what they each, they each supply. So we got, this one's got basically everything with lots of water. This one's got lots of oil. That'd be good. Uh, lots of coal or, yeah, coal. Uh, how about this one? Lots of ore. There's lots of water. So this one ought to be some sort of, uh, um, what would you call it? Uh, some sort of, like, Oh, not tourism. We already did that. Some sort of like population city. I talked about it last time as being what we're gonna do, but I'm kind of feeling like doing something different. So I'm thinking uh, we grab. Um, let's do Petrol Bay and make a oil city. I guess I don't know. Some sort of industry heavy oil, just like basically a yeah, a cesspool if you want to call it that. Just lots of pollution and whatnot. It'll be fun, I think. I'm not going to make it... I'm not even going to try to make it clean energy. I'm just going to make it all as much as polluted as possible. And just like lots of slums and... I don't know. They'll be kind of like a big empire hierarchy of... I don't know. Whatever. I'm just making up... I'm just saying random words now. Okay. Uh, so first things first. Let's grab the... Um, well, actually, let's see. I kind of like the idea of actually trying out starting with lower density um well not nah, that's all right we don't have to worry about that we'll just jump right to the high density anyway um let's see let's, let's plan this out a little bit uh so we have with us looks like let's take a look at our maps real quick and figure this all out the wind map is pointing i'm thinking in this direction yeah here we go so it's going in this direction away from the cities that's a, that's a good thing uh other ones are over there obviously uh how is our um our reserve for oil. Where's that at? Where's the oil? Here we go. Lots of oil right in the middle. So that is good. I'm thinking we're going to do most of the oil right in the middle anyway. So that's, that's a good idea. Um, no ore. No coal. Makes sense. Um, what do we have? Do we have water anywhere, hopefully? Where's the water? Water. Where are you, water? Here we go. Water everywhere, good. So we can manage that later. Uh, let's start out by just making some uh, residential and commercial zones, just to get us started. Actually, um, what do we need? We need industry really more than anything. So I might just do a bit of residential and mostly industry and that kind of stuff. So let's let's do kind of a unique looking start to this whole thing. Actually, you know what I saw in an older. I wonder if I can replicate this at all. Um, I'm thinking of some cool layouts to do for this one to make it look or make it work better with traffic. Uh, we could make it all like a big Y-shaped city with a circle in the middle. That'd be kind of cool. So basically, I would go straight out in this direction like that, and then make a little roundabout. Can I hold Shift right, or is it Control maybe? What's the button that lets you? Oh, good, it's Shift. Okay, make a perfect roundabout. Uh, something like. Uh, that's probably good. And then we're gonna put over on this side. Um, hmm. We want to have kind of good angles on this one. So let's do this way. Whoa, whoops. Avenue is going off in this direction here. I'll just go out to here. It's fine. And then Avenue is going off in this direction the opposite way. Like... It's kind of off, isn't it? That's a bit better. 
So this one's going to be a bit more uh, abstract than usual. Usually, if you guys know me, I do a lot of, uh, like, uniform-looking stuff. I'm going to really try hard to not do that. I mean, I, I always do it. I just like the efficiency aspect of it. But hopefully this time we can not do that. We can break away from that. Um, I'm aware that I didn't really finish that city over there, the, um, uh, the tourism city. Don't worry, I'm going back to it. I'm not just, like, abandoning them now. Um, I just want to take a break and do this instead because I've been working on that one for a while now. So, uh, first things first, let's do the uh, town hall, I guess. I could put it in here like this. We could do that. Should we do that? Is it straight at all? Kind of. Well, I'll just leave this to be like in the middle ground, so not have anything in it really. In fact, we could actually do. Uh, Oh, no, we can't. Never mind. Oh, no, I got an idea. It's have unlimited money. I can just go into here, build a college randomly for no reason at all. And then in the edit menu, I can grab the paths and do what I wanted to do, which would be to make some community paths going around here. Like this. Oh, angle too sharp. Wait, what? Okay, one second. Get out of here, please. Thank you. How about we do... Um, if I delete this, we'll delete... If I delete the university, we'll delete the paths, too. Let's figure that out first, I guess. Um, well, either way, we're going to do some sort of central meetup for all these paths. Um, oh, I got a better idea. Delete that. It's a circle tool. Oh. Like that. It's not very centralized, is it? I'm gonna do better than that. Okay. Sorry, I'm just. Oh, uh, what? Delete all of you. Okay. Uh, oh, whoops. Didn't mean to do any of this stuff. Um. That's good. Okay. And then we can do the straight path like that. Will that seriously change the intersection? Oh, wow, it will. What the hell? Why? Okay, one second. Let's just do it over here. I know it's not going to be very traffic efficient, but I don't think this is going to be a very high population anyway, so we should be fine without the traffic stuff. I don't think that we're going to have any major traffic problems anyway. This thing should have a pretty low population anyway. Oh, why did it just do that? That's kind of weird. Whatever. Connect you there. Connect you there and you there so now if i delete this will we lose that is my question let's try and awesome okay so apparently you can use the college paths even if you don't have a college as long as you have it for the time you're placing them so that is awesome i kind of wanted that and then we could do a little park in the middle or something i don't know it's supposed to be a big cesspool of crap but I kind of want to park or something in the middle. I can't just make it completely horrible. Oh, well, actually, I can't even make it park anyway, so whatever. We can just go to nature and put some trees down. It's kind of like a natural park anyway with the way I built the paths, so that's cool with me. Oh, can't really do much with the sides, can we? That's all right. Whatever, close enough. Okay. Anyway, that's a cool little start, I think. Let's go ahead and figure out our zoning. So I'm thinking we do some uh, people back here. Oops. Okay. Um, might as well just get some high density in here while we're already starting with it. Get my straight roads for maximum awesome. Okay. Good so far. We don't want to have everything to go off this main road, so let's just stop at that for now and do the curvy road tool for this. Ah! No. Damn it, I don't want that <laughs> other one. There we go. Ah! Why does it like go away right whenever I start placing on it? I have no idea why. Okay. Now that we got that down, we can start the little neighborhood parts. I think having an actual neighborhood would be kind of cool, so let's just do that now. Make some organic looking... Oh. 
organic looking roads. So that's not what I want to do. I want to have enough room to have two densities on each side over here, kind of like I already have set up. So I'm not gonna do too much while we start. Um, go along the beach side like this. That'd be kind of cool. So this is gonna be our first neighborhood. I'm gonna make it kind of look like an actual neighborhood, like an actual neighborhood would look. You know, this could just be like a small town. That'd be kind of cool. Hmm. Oh, we'll see. We'll see when we get there, I guess. Um, make a second connection over here somewhere. That will do it in a little bit, though. Well, actually, I think something like this would look pretty good. A connection like along here. Oh. Like that. That'll do a trick. Okay. Um, how can I make this look awesome? I like this natural tool for this kind of job, so let's try and use that to the best of our abilities. I'm thinking we do a second branch off here. Oh. Like this, I guess? Yeah, that's cool. Just to kind of give it a natural look. Maybe even do a little roundabout. Oh. Not like that, though. That's terrible. There we go. And then follow this pattern. Oh, you're not going to give it to me? That's kind of weird. Okay, whatever. Um, we'll make it go to the end over here. Ah. One second, sorry. There we go. So here I'm going to make a little circular roundabout, like a cul-de-sac kind of thing. Just for fun. Is that too big, maybe, for the, all the housing? I think it is. How big is our zoning is the question. Yeah, that's a bit too big, I think. I'll just let it stop there then. It should be fine. Um, other than that, let's also continue this road over here. I think real neighborhoods kind of look like this a little bit in the way that they do it. With I don't know if they have these little circular roundabout parts, but we'll actually... Whoa! We could try and continue it like this. We'll just stop over here, though. Maybe a little circular part right here. That'd be kind of cool. I wonder how the uh, track's gonna look to this one. I don't. I don't really know. It's pretty abstract in the design. I think it looks pretty cool though, to be honest. All right, we'll try and make a. Oh, something went off on Twitter. Okay, I'll try and make a second connection over here. Oh god, that's horrible. Let's use the actual curve tool, please. Thank you. I don't know, I'm kind of liking this so far. I usually don't do things like this, but I think it looks pretty cool. There are too many straight cities, so I need more unique ones. I'm probably going to stop soon, though, in the terms of zoning. I don't want to take up all the regional space in, like, one go. But, um, let's try and make a little turn off over here. Um, maybe a beachfront? That'd be kind of cool, actually. Let's get rid of this a little bit make it turn more like this oh no it's not very good um didn't really mean to do that but actually kind of looks pretty cool will it fit it won't fit full density let's try and make that work then i kind of want it to be still full density even if it's alongside the beach so let's try and make that to the best of our abilities what the heck like that. There we go. Then delete you and make it connect back to the main thing again. That. Send you down to the corner. And then we're going to make a curve. This will be the power station back here, I think. That's the plan. Well, actually, no. Let's leave this area to be all residential and commercial, like an actual town would be. Whoa. Why? Oh, I gotta use the curve tool anyway. Get rid of the stupid grids. Oh, whoops. Guides off. That's good. Okay. 
I'm gonna stop there for now, even though I'm gonna act eventually add more here, obviously. Um, and just zone some com er, residential back here. So, I think commercial along these these uh, these roads that are uh, connecting to back to the main roads. That way we can have people buying stuff at these little beachside shops. I think would be cool. I'll try and along here too. Keep this all residential though. Um, be some more commercial here would be good actually. Like that. Get to follow this little pattern over here and then do one more. I think we'll fit it. Actually, I can't tell, so I'm just gonna leave it blank in case we need this space. Well, see, here's the thing. I don't want to. I don't want to like make it so you can't do a full. One second here. One. Oh wow. One, two. It's the third one. And this one's one, two, three, right? I can't tell. Whatever. Close enough. I wanted to both put high density there, but I can't tell, so I'll just eyeball it, I guess. Move in here. Very abstract designs around here. And all the way back here, like that. Probably do some more beachside shops back here, just for fun. Okay. I know this stuff is going to be mostly industrial, but now that I think about it, I'm kind of liking the way this neighborhood's going. I, I may end up switching this thing over to be some sort of, uh, just happy residential town and not even a city, but I don't know. Leave in the comments down below what you think, because I'm probably not going to do any actual specialization work today, so, um, if we end up liking it as a town instead of a industry city, we could try that instead. Uh, but let me know if you want the industry or the town in the comments, and I'll decide based off that, I guess. What was that I just got? I don't even know what that was. Get all these set. We'll stop here, and then we can zone some commercial along that side in a minute. Oh, we don't have any water. It's not good. Let's stop that for just a moment while we get the water going. Um... Just a water tower is good for now. We don't want to overspend yet. Hopefully the city actually makes a, plot, a profit. That's kind of the plan too. So I'll try and shoot for that. Let's grab a oil power plant. It could probably go um, back here now that I think about it. It's not, it's not a bad spot. I'll probably zone this all commercial then or, or alongside it so they don't people don't get mad. Like that. And demolish you guys. That should do it. Now we just gotta wait for the people to move in. And while we're at it, we'll just go ahead and put it back into fast forward. And we can watch the simulation do its job. I don't know if that's really like an actual natural neighborhood. I think it kind of is. Imagine how my neighborhood works. You know, you kind of turn into a side street. And then there's more side streets all along. I don't know. I think it's pretty cool. They're probably a bit more linear than that, but whatever. It's still. Power, power. It's coming, don't worry. I like how it's kind of a bayside thing, though. That's kind of cool. Oh, can I do it? Ooh. Can I do a, a, a water trade port? Or maybe like a... Um, well, the water trade port would... Well, wait. What about a... Where is it? Boats. Here we go ferry section would be kind of cool. Let's do a, a little ferry over here. Would be pretty cool, actually. Um, we'll put it... We'll put it here. That way we can have a little roundabout back here at the end to connect it. So... Like... That's not really what I wanted, but... Um, or something like that would be kind of cool. Oh. No. It's also weird. No. Perfect. 90 degree turn, please. Would be nice. That's good for now. Then we'll connect it like this. 
Whatever, it's close enough to being a little roundabout. I don't know if that really worked too well, but whatever. Don't really care. We'll make some more trees if I can. Or like two trees. <laughs> whatever, it's close enough. Get that residential in here wherever I can, even though it's not going to grow. Kind of blocking some places, but whatever. Why am I even zoning in there? I don't, I don't know. Nothing's going to... Actually, I'll just get rid of these zones, too, so we don't end up getting weird buildings that are blocking other buildings out and stuff like that. Okay. Um, now we got that going. It's like our city is slowly gaining population, which is good. We're going to need some utilities soon, so let's go ahead and start putting those down. We have the fire, obviously. We'll put that down back here. Oh, we don't want the full one yet. Let's have a small one for now. Trying to be conscious of my spending, kind of cut back. I know it's sandbox, but I kind of want it to be like an actual city, a good one. And I don't want to overspend at the beginning and make it not work as well. So, no sense in that, I guess. We'll take this one kind of slowly, unlike the other ones, and work our way up. The actual town. Huh. Put the fire over here somewhere that's already useless anyway, because of all the buildings that I put down. The fire there and the health can be here. Police can be over here on this side, right? Yeah, that's good. So it's like traffic it might be a bit of a problem right away, but we can fix that with the help of our trusty roads. We'll make that not a four-way stop, though. Try and connect from over here, maybe. Like that. Should reduce traffic a little bit. Health coverage is available, that's good. Okay, we're gonna need some jobs, so industries next. Let's go ahead and grab the high density and pull some road over in this direction. We need grids. Like that. Zone off the in oh, the industry side over here. There we go. Connect them fairly well. Let's do the industry a bit more linear than the other side, just to keep the. I don't know, make it work better. I think. There we go. And like that. Should keep our industry working well. Oh, that's not the right size, is it? Damn it. We can have small and big industry on the first building. That's not too big of a deal. Or not first building. The first uh, little lot, I guess, we allocate for them. There we go. Oh. What? That's kind of weird. Why not here? I don't know. Okay, then. Uh, and then along this side back here. It's good like that. Okay. Um, I wanted to... Oh, right. Here, we can still make it work. Um, I mean, the road's got a bit farther, so we can then go ahead and try the double grid size. So along here. Let's make this go a bit farther first, so we can zone based off it. Okay, close enough. Put our factories down, or zoning down for factories. Should bring in lots of jobs and people. That's good. How are we doing? Making money now, that's good. And looks like life's good, hooray. Wow, he's medium, medium wealth? Oh, I guess it's from all the health and the ferry terminal. That's cool. We need a cruise ship dock. Yeah. Okay. I do like these buildings over here, how they're growing. Are we getting anything anything over here though? That's weird. Industry demand's high. Everything's high right now, it looks like, for some reason. I don't know why everything's high. It doesn't make any sense, but oh maybe from the tourism? I don't know. Usually it's one way or the other, but okay. 
Nice. I like this little roundabout at the beginning, too. I think that was a good call. Although, this could become a problem later on. Hopefully not. I don't know why it's so much traffic, like, right here, specifically. That's alright. Right, we need waste treatment. Uh, huh. Grab that. Sewage outflow. Let's put this down... Um, I guess over here by these random homes. And then, oh, sorry guys. What? I'm not, I'm not that close to you guys. Ooh, cool, the ferry's coming in. Okay, um, now we need the, waste should be okay for now. Although, we probably should make a waste one anyway because it's a, got lots of industry over here anyway, so whatever. Yeah, I think we're probably going to go with the Industry City anyway, but um, I still think it'll look cool with all these cool, unique-looking roads and stuff, so hopefully all goes well. Heck this back here just to get a better-looking road section. Or, I mean, better working road section with more of an out output in this side. Well, actually, we could probably do it over here. It's probably the better thing to connect anyway. There you guys go better way out should reduce traffic hopefully we'll see we made it worse over here but whatever it'll be fine well actually this can be medium density if we're not gonna so we don't have to make any more uh make any more stoplights we can just have what too close to existing intersection whatever that way we only have a stop sign and we don't stop traffic that's the point okay um, now what? So we need to have a government building. Well, we don't need to, but it looks cool. Oh, I can make a mayor's house already. I mean, you don't have to, but it would be sweet to have one by the beach. Yeah. Because I'm a partying mayor and I have beach parties all the time. All right, let's do some upgrading because we can do it better than last time. Last time was okay, but I can do better than that. Party wing in the front. Party, wait. This is the front party in the back. Whatever, I don't care. I'll put it. I'll actually put it this way. It looks kind of cool like that. Bell tower can be on top of the party wing, obviously. Where else would I put it? Ooh, I can have the copter thing on top. Oh, just kidding. No, I can't. Um, I'll put it somewhere else later. But the pool needs to go smack dab in the middle. In the back. Because that's cool. Um. Where can the balcony go? Maybe over here would be pretty good. Or in front of the party deck would be even better. Let's do that. The guest wing. Apparently can't be connected to the house for some reason. I don't know why it can't be connected to the house, but whatever. Um, we can put it by the limo. Well, the limo garage should... Oh, wait. This is what? The extension wing. One there. I basically just want the biggest house as possible without all this weird extension stuff what else can i add on to the actual house itself probably nothing more oh i can do this stuff so e eagle wing should go in the front thing i don't know why it faces backwards that's kind of weird whatever uh we can have the fountain in the middle obviously this thing should go in the back um hmm limo garage obviously so i have a limo I mean, these kind of, I can have all four of them, I guess. Um, this can go in the front, then. It's kind of a weird place to put it, but whatever. Uh, with this thing watching it over here. Wait. That was, a, that was a sports car. Limo should be across from it right here. Wait, is that across from it? There we go. Okay, greenhouse can go in the back. And the tennis courts can go back also. By the barbecue pit. Oh, that's a good spot for it. Sweet. Um, and then we can have the guest house by the limo garage. That should be good. Helipad in the back over here. And we are set. That is a pretty sweet house. Glove is high wealth moving in too. That's pretty cool. Okay. Wow, lots of green happy faces. I like that. See that. Um, 
I mean, education would be probably a good idea. Let's do that now while we still can. Um, what do you guys want? Probably the little fire thing, right? I don't want to do that yet. You guys are going to burn the whole freaking town down because you suck at putting out fires. No thanks. Ask later. Uh, let's use the... <coughs> grade school would be... I've heard that it's kind of useless. Like, you're supposed to just do the college because anything else is like... They don't keep track of ages of sims, but... To be totally honest, um... With this being so small and all, I don't see the point in making higher, bigger, more expensive schools quite yet. So we'll start with the, uh, start with these, you know, small schools. Put that there. Um, just fully upgrade it for the hell of it, because we already can, and we probably should. There we go. Uh, do the. I always do my schools the same way. I don't know why. I always do like the double like that. It looks best like that. It takes the least amount of space too, I think. Max out our school real quick with the signs and everything. And then we can go ahead and put some bus stops down. So, ooh, getting some more dense buildings already. Sweet. So we're going to want to have basically bus stops everywhere we have houses. So, educate. Oh. That was kind of unnecessary. I'll fix that in a minute. Get rid of this one and put it somewhere closer over here. Delhi to you. What else was I going to do over here again? Oh yeah, library, right. Put that somewhere more in the inner, the inner town part. Maybe, ooh, townhouses. Hooray. And some apartment buildings, whatever these are. Awesome. Okay, let's do this thing uh, somewhere far away from all the other stuff so we get the even spread uh, happiness and stuff. Um, let's put this one alongside this road. Coming in. There we go. Should improve our rating in terms of education. Eventually, anyway. Not now, but... What the hell? My Twitter feed's blown up. I don't know why. I say blown up. I got like t two tweets. <laughs> no one follows me on Twitter. I have like 50 followers or something, even though I have like 5,000 subscribers, I don't know. That's crazy, I'm almost at 5,000, I just, I just realized that like, I don't know, it's insane. SimCity 5 came out and I had like, just over, I want to say not even 2,000 yet, and now I'm at 4,800 or something, so thank you guys if you, if you joined in, uh, I don't know, I, I think you're all coming from, a lot of you guys come from Web, I know that Web Gaming Central, he posts with me, so... I think naturally we share subs in both directions, but um, I think it was a lot of SimCity that, that brought you guys in, but that's great. I'm welcome if you're new. Uh, I know I had a lot of subs before this too, so I I tried to uh, post Royal Cycling as well for you guys because I know that was a big game before I started playing this game, so uh, I'm staying true to my, my core fan base as well, don't worry. I like all these games actually, so I try and keep a balance. I know I get a lot of comments saying when's the next episode of this, you know. Um, I try and keep a good balance all, of all my episodes, um, you know, I upload like, usually trade off series every day, and I do like one upload a day, it's usually a pretty decent, um, and doable amount for me anyway, um, but it could increase, especially when summer comes around, that'll probably be a time when I start uploading maybe twice a day, we'll see if that, if that becomes a thing, but, uh, yeah, we'll see, I know, normally, uh, quantity isn't everything, a lot of times it's good to kick back and make better videos and you know take the time to edit things better and maybe upload less but we'll see where i go from here i guess right now i'm pretty happy with what we're doing now sim city and stuff oh we need a garbage dump so let's do that now i don't know why i was talking about that it just popped in my head so thought i'd talk about it okay garbage dump can go there um we should be fine for now with that the way it is what do you guys want health issues probably from all the pollution that makes sense um, I think, oh, fires are probably also becoming a problem. Okay, let's do a uh, patient waiting room. Oh, damn it. They're just showing these houses. All right, whatever. Um, I can do that then. With an ambulance bay in the back. Kind of connected across like that. That's kind of cool. Um, put a little sign or something. I don't know. Something random. Probably delete it later anyway and build a bigger one, but for now we're okay. I think our traffic is actually managing pretty well. This is actually not a bad system. I mean, 
I think this is probably a mistake. Actually, let's get rid of this uh, street light and make it a uh, a medium density. Yep, bulldoze that. I don't care. I'll fix it in a minute. This needs to be medium density so we don't have a major traffic uh, problem later. Like, whatever. I don't care. Sorry. You lose your new house to a road. <laughs> uh, we need the library back. Actually, it could go somewhere in the inner city more. Not inner city, inner town, whatever. Like there. Kind of like that, actually. How is the rest of the stuff doing? I think other than that, traffic's pretty good. Not bad, anyway, for 8,000 people, which actually is a pretty good amount for a starting city. We've only been playing for, like, what, 35 minutes or something? 30? Actually, it's getting kind of towards the end of the episode, so... I think we're going to wrap it up here for now, um, but this is the city so far, let me know what you think, and uh, if I should name it something cool, if you have any ideas, I think it's a pretty unique city, probably one of the more unique ones that I've built so far, uh, definitely a different design, <laughs> I usually don't do things like this, so I think it's going to turn out well, we need more shopping apparently, but uh, regardless guys, that was the episode of the Sims 5 Let's Play, and um, more to come as well as Tycoon 3's, so look out for that, and as always guys, thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.